Hey guys, it's Tiffany. Today's math problem of the day says convert to a simplified fraction. We have 24%. So when I'm dealing with the percent, I want to remember that the percentage is the same thing as an amount over 100. So I can write that as a fraction. So this becomes 24 over 100. So our percentage is already in a fraction form, but they did clarify that they want a simplified fraction. So now I just need to make sure that I divide to get the most simplified form of this exact same fraction. So in this case, I can see that dividing by two would work and that would allow me to make my numerator 12 and my denominator 50, but I can see that I can divide by two again, and that would give me six over 25, and that is the most simplified form. If in the beginning you thought to divide by four, you would get the six over 25 with only one step of division. If you use a smaller number, that's not the greatest common factor to simplify something, you're gonna end up having to simplify more than once, which is fine, it just you know might take a little longer and sometimes that's the thing to do like i mean if the numbers are really big and you know they're both even you might as well just divide by two but you might have to do that multiple times because you don't know when it's going to end or be in the most simplified form so six over 25 is the answer to today's math problem of the day guys please like this video and subscribe to my channel it'll make sure you get notification for all of my videos that are coming out every day and as always here's tomorrow's math problem of the day See if you can solve it before I do. Then head over to supereasymath.com and click on math videos. Once you're there, you can have access to all of my videos where I teach everything in order with notes the way you need it.